Um, so this one is made out of like a pink suede material and um, yeah, it has a lot of panels and the corset part in the back, I mean the oh. lacing mm -hmm. and the grommets. And these are boning channels which hold synthetic boning. Do you know the history of the corset? I I do. I do, kind of. It was... It was originally stays, which helped for support for like um, working in fields and things. And the stays were more... had less shape and they were more like functional. And they still had boning and they were pretty much like, like solidly flat in the front and they covered the chest too. Mm -hmm. And then in the Victorian era, the corset was like more popularized and it became more like a fashion thing. I think stays were still around then. I'm not entirely sure, but stays were pretty popular and then, well, for working and stuff. And then the corset was more like for fashion. And Trina, this is the first time you learn a corset? Yep. And then when I lace them, I lift these two the thing over and then doing the crossing again so that I can lace it more like this. So the tie would be in the middle, which is where it's supposed to be. Tell me if it's too tight. Oh, no, it's okay. Okay. 